السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. Finally, I want to share with you the hadith of Prophet Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم about ليلة القدر. He says, من قام ليلة القدر إيمانا ويحتسابا غفر له ما تقدم من ذنبه. Who you can stand in the night of Laylatul Qadr, meaning pray. So the best thing you can do in Laylatul Qadr is a nice thought is pray. Nawafil, nawafil, nawafil. And the best thing you can do is when you are in sajda. Just make du'as. Just cry to Allah and make du'as. But then the Prophet ﷺ didn't just say pray. He gave certain qualities to their prayers. So let me explain those qualities. One, imanan. We will pray before Allah out of faith, meaning it's not just faithfully. They were driven, they were completely convinced that this prayer is going to be the best thing that happened to me. They have this confidence and the reliance of on Allah on this prayer like, like no others. That's one. Then, wa ihtisab. Ihtisab means someone who takes full stock of themselves. I'm aware of my sins. I'm aware of my flaws. I'm aware of, my, of what I have done. I'm aware of what I'm ashamed of before Allah. And I'm coming before Allah, standing in prayer, ashamed and humiliated, and completely convinced that Allah will forgive me and bless me and will let me my sins pass. So I'm coming before Allah, humiliated in tears. In full account, I'm full account of myself like a confessional prayer. This is a confessional prayer. Ihtisaban. If you can pull that up, غفر له ما تقدم من ذنبه. Whatever took place of any kind of embracing sin such a person had done has all been granted to be forgiven. All of it is granted to be forgiven. If we can stand before Allah in that kind of prayer tonight, that kind of prayer is harder to do together. That kind of prayer is much easier to do when you are by yourself. This is the time. This is one of those nights. Or if, if you are lazy by yourself, of course, come to the masjid, enjoy the jamaah and do it that. But this is the night where you just want to just be. You and Allah in your tears. That's what it needs to be. Stand before Allah, recite the Quran and make dua. Make duas before Allah and become those that are fortunate enough to have found in the Laylatul Qadr and found forgiveness of Allah in it. Thank you.